Rebecca Brand, and today we're gonna make roasted butternut squash. So you gotta cut your butternut. It is tough, you gotta get your strongest, most heavy duty knife, and you really put your elbow grease into it. You slice it down the middle, because what you wanna do is get the seeds out of it. The goal is to get them equal. I didn't do it quite right, but that's okay. It's not gonna matter. I'm a little pack rat, and I like to save these little bags in the grocery store, and they become like my trash center. So use your big spoon with like the most sharp edge, and just take that seed out. It doesn't matter so much if you get it all out. That's okay. Preheat the oven to 400 degrees. I have a little olive oil here. I like to olive oil it, and this is why. When you put it flat down in your baking sheet, when I take it off later, it's not gonna stick, and that's good. So I kind of put them in back-to-back -back blackjack. So into the oven it goes. Now I'm gonna leave that in there for an hour and 20 minutes. I want it to get really soft and it'll look a little roasted on the outside. So we'll come check that in a little bit. Let's see if that squash is ready. It is beautifully roasted. So what you wanna do is use a spatula to pull it up, flip it over. Oh yeah, it's so beautiful and golden. That is a harvest dish. How pretty is that? Many people just like to add butter and salt. I add my butter. Now you can stop there. Personally, I would put a little bit of brown sugar on it. That is so creamy and luscious and rich and deliciously sweet. Subscribe to my channel and we're gonna make a lot more dishes. Bon appetit. Mm, yummy.